So which is greater, one-third or two-fifths? So when we look at these two circles here, this one's divided into three. If we number it, one, two, three, each one of these pieces is one-third. It's one part here of the whole. Over here we have five pieces. Each part is one-fifth. So we come back over here, we're going to shade in one of the three pieces. So we shade this one part in, and that's one-third. Over here we'll shade in two pieces. That's two-fifth part over the whole. So when you look at this, it's a little bit difficult to see which one's bigger. It looks like two-fifth, the shaded area here for two-fifth, is larger than one-third. So visually looking at this, we could say two-fifths is going to be larger than one-third. But if we converted this to decimals, divided one by three and two by five, that might help. So let's do that. One divided by three, that equals 0 0.3, and that number repeats. Two divided by five, that equals 0 0.4. So we were right looking at it visually. Two-fifths, that's greater than one-third, because 0.4 is greater than 0.33 with the threes repeating. So that's how you figure out which is bigger, one-third or two-fifths. Turns out that two-fifths is larger than one-third. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.